this morning we are leaving Delhi and we are heading on the train to Agra. It's about an hour and a half train ride and then we're gonna be in Taj Mahal city. So I'm gonna sit back and enjoy this lovely rose <laughs> they gave us. Very random, but I'm not complaining. So we are at our first stop in Agra. This is the Agra Fort. It is a huge fort, the largest in India, and it was built in the Mughal period. And if you look around, you're going to see it's made up of red sandstone and the white marble. So we're going to take a look around and see all the beautiful gardens. There are so many cool gardens and architecture. This place is huge. It is really hot today. This is way hotter than Delhi was. How you doing? Blair. Pretty toasty, but it's beautiful. That's true. All right, so it's now starting to get crazy busy here now that it's getting later in the afternoon. So many people. hotel and it is freshening up time. I got about an hour to kind of change, get ready to do more photos and a sunset at the Taj Mahal. It's going to be epic. So I'm going to get ready and I'll see you guys a bit. La, 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 la. Alright, so we just got through the security and we are walking into the entranceway that is the main, I guess, entrance or gate to the Taj Mahal. I can see it, I can see it. We're at the Taj Mahal, guys. Woo! Wonder number six and seven for me, and I'm super excited to be here. This, the sun is setting, so it's gonna be amazing, beautiful photos for us. We're gonna come back for sunrise tomorrow. So let's look around and let me tell you a bit more about it. So this is the new family. This is what happens when you take photos. Every time you take a photo, you get bombarded by people that want to take our photo. And they jump in the photos. Yeah. It's a bit of chaos. It's really, really hard to get. 80 kind of clear shot. And I mean, there's over 50,000 people that visit the site every day. So over 50,000 people are visiting the Taj Mahal. And uh, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have photos with a solid 2,000 of them, so. about the Taj Mahal. So the Taj Mahal is actually a mausoleum dedicated to Shah Jahar's wife. Now Shah Jahar was the fifth Mughal ruler of India and his wife, before she passed, asked him to build her this grand mausoleum and he did. So they started construction in 1631 and it took 22 years to build and over 20,000 people worked on it. Kind of crazy, but as you can see, the final result is quite amazing. I think it's kind of interesting that the closer you get to it, the smaller it seems. At least that's what I found. Yeah, for sure. When you're walking in, it looks way smaller. What no, when I you're saying? walking in, it looks bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. It looks you're bigger. No, I want to stay. Okay. Okay, so now we are going to go head into the mausoleum, which you actually can't film anything or take photos of, but I will catch you guys when we come back out. Oh my goodness, guys, the sun is setting and it is absolutely Gorgeous. Like, I can't even put to words how beautiful 
the Taj Mahal is looking right now. The wind has died down, and but you still have like this foggy haze, which is making it really like romantic and mysterious. It's really, really pretty. So we are now gonna leave, and I think go grab some dinner, and then we'll be back again for sunrise. All right, that's right, Taj. That's right, Taj. Bright and early to wait for the gate to open because we are going to be getting some more photos and because of the Taj Mahal, but this time from a different angle. There she is again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm back. You never left. I know. <laughs> <You're never left. laughs> this is super, super random, but it's literally a field that is across the river from the Taj Mahal. So, there's a couple other people here, but realistically, not that many at all. So we're gonna go try and get a good spot and hopefully see an awesome sunrise this morning.